Hey guys, Super Silverstone here. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be looking into some extra stuff with events, and we're going to be finishing off learning about events. And we are also going to be trying to make, in this video, you get a plugin where when you join the game, you can actually get a death message, and it will change your death message to something else when you join and leave the game. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to create a new listener file. Uh, I'm going to call this um, jo join player listener, and we're going to start off with implementing listener. So my challenge for you last video was you actually had to try and see if you could make it where when you join and leave the game, it changes your death message. So to do that, you're gonna do at event handler, you're gonna create a method, public void on on player join, just like that. And we're going to do player join event, e, which you can use e or event, I'm gonna use event for consistency. And now we are going to do an on player join event. So we can say if uh, event dot get player is not equal to null, then we can set um, player player equal to event dot get player. Now, if you don't know what I'm doing here, it's okay. I'm just setting it as a variable, right? And we're going to do player dot set a join no sorry event dot get join message and then we could do event dot set join message actually we don't really need to get the join message we just want to set it I'm going to say chat color dot yellow. You'll learn about chat color. Uh, this is just for making it fancy and to actually go with the joke. Um, but there we go. Chat color yellow. And you might notice this is deprecated. Uh, that's okay. Uh, we can just put at deprecated and it will get rid of it. So that's what we're doing here. We don't even need this part. Uh, I just have it there anyway because it's important to use. And then when you're down here, we're going to do at event handler. And this one we won't actually be able to see uh, because I don't have two accounts logged on right now. So you're just going to have to trust me that this works. Well, actually, we could see it in console. Uh, player leave. What is it called? It's not a player. You see, right now where I don't know what it's called, I can open up Google. Uh, leave. Uh, event. Bed event. Player bed leave event. What is it called? Player interactive event. What is it called? Not respawn. Quit event. Right here, you see? Called when a player leaves the server. Player quit event. So now we can do a player. See how helpful that thing is? To just be able to know. Wow, it's crazy. If uh, event dot get player is not equal to null. I usually put this condition because it helps with for more advanced stuff. Uh, player player is equal to event dot dot get player just like that uh sorry if this also goes a little slower i'm recording it in a different way than i have my other videos so sorry about that uh event dot set quit message i'm going to say chat color dot yellow plus quotes uh hero brian left the game all right, so that's all we're going to be doing uh, in this. Now, the one other thing we do need to do is we need to set up 
set it up in our main class. So we need to do go in here and we need to do bucket dot get plugin manager dot register events new um, player listener this. Now one of the main problems you will have there are two main problems when it comes to listeners. A you forgot to uh, put it and register it in your main class or B you in your class you didn't put at event handler. Those are the two main things that will really get you and it will be so annoying when you realize oh god I've been sitting here for an hour and I forgot to put at event handler. So yeah. Uh, make sure you do those two things because you will forget. Trust me. <laughs> we're going to do rebuild. I'm going to open up Minecraft. And we're going to do slash reload. And here we go. We're going to leave the game. Look at what it says. Hero Brian left the game. And when I join, it says Hero Brian joined the game. Just like that. Easy, easy, easy. So that is how you set custom like commands like that. Not custom commands, God. Uh, when you set how you set player death messages and not death messages. So that is how you set player join and leave messages, and that is also how you can set up a listener, just like that. And it's super super simple to do. Uh, this chat color will go way into depth, into a ton of depth uh, in another video. Uh, don't use it if you don't know what you're doing. That's my biggest thing. If you don't know what this event equals null is, don't use it. If you don't know what this player player equals event, if you don't know what it is, don't use it. All right, or copy and paste and know that you'll get errors. Either way, file save all. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell, turn on those notifications, go down to the comments, leave a comment. I really appreciate you guys uh, sticking around with me during this as we go through plugin development. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody.